Oh, look at this guy. Look at this guy. He's fish is this the same guy? No, this is, uh... <laughs> Hold on, I'm not even trying. What does that say? I don't even Colonelin? Colonelin. Okay, so Colonelin's working on the, uh... How do you do? I'm just gonna call him Colin. Colin's working on the fishing with no pole. He's got a pole, but he's got no string on the end, so he's just continually whipping at the water. So hoping maybe a fish will jump up at the right time and smack her. He's got him. Yeah, no, Colonelin's not catching a whole hell of a lot with his fishing pole with no no line. What? They just they keep doing that. I don't understand why they're doing that. I do like what's happening here though. Some nice crops. Get some peppers coming in. Peppers, everyone, peppers. We should have some tools being made. Yep, tools are being made. People are getting their tools. Get your tool. Get your tool. There you go. Good job. Still have one without a tool, but if you're gonna say iron, okay. Iron is low, I understand, but I have iron right there. And also, I think still some iron sitting out here, and maybe some other iron? I don't know. You can get plenty of iron here. Also, there's iron here. What's happening? Use the iron, I'm not building anything else. Yeah, big dope. I know tools are low, that's what we're working on. But as of right now, everyone's got a tool, which is excellent. Everybody say, yay! No? Okay. That was your chance. You blew it. This was an interactive episode, and you blew it. Let's try it again. Everybody say, yay! Better. Much better. So we are, uh, working on this stuff, I guess. There's more iron out here that can be collected. Just nobody's collecting right now. I have a laborer. I mean, they should be working on it a little bit, I think. Okay. I'm going to unpause this. I'm going to allow that laborer now. Oh, I have builders just sitting. Oh, no, I don't. Okay. So I'm going to let that laborer become a builder, because if he's not going to do anything at all, he might as well come over and start laying the groundwork a little bit. Look at that. I'm up to seven tools now. Everyone's still happy and healthy. My herbs are holding up. My food will hold up again. I have now more food. I realize I have a few more mounts, but I'm, I got more food. My students are becoming... Oh, my students are becoming productive adults in my society here. I'm very happy for them. Someone is starving. These people are always starving. The problem is you eat too much. I don't want to be the one who points this out to you, Ezekiel. But, uh, Ezekiah, I guess it is. But, you know eat less, and, uh, we'll be starving all the time. Oh, you? You're starving? Oh, I'll bet. I can't have you starving. And how are you starving? You don't even, oh, yeah, you do live here. Okay. Oh, boy. Okay. So it begins. I got three people who are currently starving. Do they all live in this house? I assume. Zizekia. Beth. New. Yep. And what's Misty doing? Misty's eating well. Oh, she's the only one that's not starving yet. Time will tell if she can make it. Oh, I'm rooting for her. Looks look good. Hold that field, baby. See how Taylor doesn't have a whole lot of different outfits to hand out. Everyone's wearing a white shirt and yellow dress. Is that the, the outfit? What are we running in Utopia here? Everyone's got the same outfit. And great. There's our first starvation death. Well, we knew it was coming. Uh, it's a good time to stop cutting wood though, so what the hell? Just want me to stop it. Uh, very concerned about the other citizens of that house. Fortunately every other house seems to be doing okay. Unfortunately, they don't feel like sharing their food at all with our starving citizens. And there goes another. Oh, it's a Hezekiah. Uh-oh, there goes their child. <laughs> Destance. And Beth is sure to follow. Oh, no, Beth died. So who's our... Oh, no, baby. Oh, Misty. Oh, no, not Misty. Who's now living with another family. Right away. Beth Lamar and Caddy were like, Don't, we'll live there. We'll take care of you, Misty. Oh, no. Well, Misty... You're about to join your parents in a better place than Macville. 
But everyone else, you'll be fine. Uh, at least she's a child, and she's not helping me at all, so... It does set me back 12 years. This stuff is still waiting to be collected. There it is. Let's go visit them. So this would be Misty's grave, and that would be Beth's... Oh, that's Beth's grave, I think, right there. Oh, no, that's it right there. Of course, I don't know who's who. But basically, we certainly currently have five citizens in the graveyard. Um, don't need a bigger graveyard. Alright, so what, am I in danger of anything else besides people dying of starvation? No, they feel good. Oh, one of my farmers died? I can't have that. I cannot have that. Wait, where did one of my farmers go? They weren't, none of those, oh, one of them was a farmer. Oh no. Well, F. Lamar and Caddy, you wanted the house. You didn't bother to check the cupboard before you got in there. So, I have this well, and when this fire happened, they all ran to the well, and I was very happy. Because I didn't ever see the well get used before. So there they were. They hit the well. They went over to the blacksmith. But then they all decided the ocean was closer. And I don't know why I have a well if they can use the water. They all just streamed back and forth to the river. Um, so now I'm thinking the well is really necessary if you don't live near water. Or maybe if it's too far. Like maybe on this side is where the well should be. But I guess if there's a fire here they can use that well. We have another house now with no food in it. Where are we? We're in the middle of summer. We got about, I don't know, a month or two. Oh boy. So. Mm, yeah, we're about a month or two <laughs> before we're gonna start yielding anything. Alright, we don't need any more yield. We got plenty of tools. We currently have 30 tools. I probably should have kept a bit of a closer eye on that. Let's keep the houses going, although I've lost some people, so I don't know if I necessarily need another house. But what the hey, we're all about progress in Macville, regardless of what that costs us in the long run. We're not replanting trees, but wood doesn't seem to be much of an issue at the moment. Especially since we're going to be hitting this forest. I'm really not... I should be... The way I should be playing this is I should be playing it so that I'm worried about the long term. So I have a forester replanting trees. Maybe I should be thinking about a trading port should be thinking about things like quarries so I can start getting stone from the ground instead of just relying on these patches that are around us. But I gotta be honest with you, I don't see a big picture situation happening here. This town is in trouble. But, the good news is, we are we're gonna have a lot of, a lot of food. This, this is gonna help quite a bit. Also, the fact that some people already died is gonna help our feeding situation. It's gonna hurt every other way, but the people who are still alive will eat like kings. Um, we are going to... What does it cost me for the trading port? Because I really, I want to see if we can get something kind of fun going here. Um, market trading post. Oops. Cost me 82 wood, 80 stone, 40 iron. But let's imagine where we might have such a thing. So, this part goes on the water. Right? No? Maybe not. This way. Oh, yeah, because that's like a, that's a hill over there. Oh, look at that. Look where that fits. Oh, snug as a bug in a rug, eh? Oh, look at that. Look at that, would you? That fits so nice and clean. Alright, we're gonna put that there, we're gonna pause it. We obviously have no interest in building that at the moment, but that is where our trading post is gonna go. My goodness! It's almost like I planned it. Okay. How many builders does it take? It's going to require four builders to max capacity. I don't have the materials on the builders for it, but I might start it a little at a time. Should probably finish these houses first. He's building it by himself. Well done, sir. Well done. 
no, 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 not another farmer. F. Lamar, you know what? You deserve, you son of a bitch. You moved right in on this house. Ugh, with well, a kid still living there, stunned from the loss of her family. You just walked in like you owned the place. And you didn't bother to think about why did they die in the first place? Food. They didn't have any. Now you don't have any. Alright, that house is done. Let's build this one. Screw it. So we're we're managing to save it off a little bit. Uh, we're getting there, we're getting close to harvesting this food. I do believe oh, are we starting already? Is this being harvested or or did they not plant all the crops? I didn't notice before. Being harvested, I'm not sure. No, it's not being harvested. It's just not gonna yield. Oh, that well, that's that buzzkill. How did that happen? Oh, because I lost that one farmer when she died, and I didn't notice. Oh man! So what I gained here, I lost, and I just lost another farmer, Ethelmar. Oh, Ethelmar.